If you, if you want to get to this level, this is professional level, what it's going to take is cutting back on the biscuit, okay? <laughs> then you're going to have to go on a low-carb diet, wow. and we're going to have to do some cardio, okay? I believe in you. I don't think that you can't do it, but it's going to take some work, okay? <laughs> 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 Leonard, we're in the Tell museum us. in Charlotte, and we're learning about uh, American history, and we're looking at old clothes and stuff. What have you learned so far? I learned a lot about about um, where slaves lived and how much, how they didn't get paid as much for um, as people who had lighter skin, and they just get paid as much when they pick cotton. I learned that. Definitely not possible physically, but you can do it with food. So you learn how to do, like you said, Chinese food. You work with the wok and everything like that. Um, a really great thing about that is that before you actually focus on the country that you're going to be working with, you actually learn about it upstairs in the classroom. Um, a lot of people don't know that. A lot of people who cook every day don't really realize what they're doing. Like the one pot cooking method was actually um, established in, in Africa. You know, so you learn things like that. All the food that's produced in there comes to this lab. And this is our um, essentials to dining room lab, which is a freshman lab. So in this lab, you're learning how to do everything essential to dining, how to set up a guest check, how to set up a table the correct way, how to read wine labels, how to serve people properly, and the two-pot tea um, service method. Is there any questions? Um, it's really nothing bad. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that one is so cool. Oh, the little yeah. cabinet. Yeah.
because they've already been evicted out of their home, you guys. We're in a crisis situation. We're not just handing money out and just going, hey, everybody come see us, okay? It is a crisis mode. We get money through the county, we get money through the state, a little bit. Does anybody have a plan? Yeah, so, so let's people, just go do jeans. Some people do shirts, stuff like that. Let's have actually since children's and yeah, I'll, I'll pull up a three church. people. I mean, one person. We need station. three. We need three groups. One person. Yeah, we need three groups. But this whole group, we need three. But three. But one people at each you no know, clothing line, and then like a lot of people are here. You know what I'm saying? Everybody. Yeah. Feel what I'm saying? People that can't afford to pay their rent and have to use their money for uh, pay their rent and can't afford uh, clothes from Walmart, places like that. You know, we're just helping them out. You need a joke. Joke, you need to learn how to read.